Hey, this is Dan with SupplyHouse.com, and in this video, we're going to unbox a Bluefin Manifold. Cover folds back like that. Here we have an eight-loop manifold that's held up by these cardboard pieces to keep it all centered so it's not banging around in transit. There we go. The supplies down here on the bottom, the returns up here on the top. It all ships complete as one package here. Once you get it, you can undo the screws and like flip these around or swap top and bottom here. Comes with a little baggie with the instruction manual in there. Let's take a look. It's got some instructions for connecting the tubing, adjusting the flow meters, which are the red guys here. It's got some dimensions as well for uh, pipe connections, overall lengths of the different manifolds and uh, model names. You gotta be careful though, a lot of this is in metric still. Rather than CV, it shows the KV, which is the metric equivalent. And they've got a lot of uh, strange thread sizes. A lot of it is BSP rather than national pipe thread, so you can't just screw a regular fitting onto the connections of this thing. You have four boxes packed over here on the side of the manifold. Two of them here, it's this guy and this guy. These are the, uh, the end caps. And these will screw in on either end you want. That's just the drain and fill valve. This thing unscrews. There should be standard garden hose thread on these things now. Put the garden hose thread up to it. And this is actually a valve at the back of the cap. Put on there and you can open and close it. So don't lose that valve cap. The other two boxes you get, you get the supply and return ball valves. One's red and one's blue. Not that it matters which one you put it, but it helps you remember which is which. Uh, these screw on the end opposite to the drain valves. They've got the little temperature well built into them so you can see what your, uh, your delta T is across the manifold. And they've just got the shutoffs. And again, like I said, these aren't regular national pipe threads connecting to the manifold. So you can't just put anything you want on there. They are union, so you can unscrew them and remove the, uh, the manifold from the system if you need to. The pipe connections are just standard one inch national pipe thread, so you can put whatever sort of fitting you want on that to get to your supply and return pipe thread. So this is the red one for the supply. And here we got the blue one for the return. Yeah, so typically the blue one's gonna be up top here. It could be either on the left or the right side. It's just hand tightened in. It's straight thread, so it's all gasketed. You don't need a pipe wrench to get these on here. And same deal with the red. And if you want, you could even come in from the other side if it's easier for you, wherever your pipes are coming and going from. And then the drain valves would go on the other side. The ball valves do also include a little instruction manual in case anything is unclear. So that's everything that comes included with the manifold. When you're purchasing, make sure you get all the loop fitting assemblies for the PEX tubing you're going to attach to it, because those don't come bundled with it. For more information on Bluefin manifolds, visit SupplyHouse.com or email us with any questions.